Today we're taking a look at a brand new coin on the channel, AVAX, aka Avalanche. We're going to be performing some technical analysis on it and making some predictions of where we can expect to see AVAX go in the near future. Let's get into it. Welcome into the AVAX chart guys and as you can see it's currently sitting at $105.25. I'll zoom out just so you can get an idea. This is sort of all we can see on the chart at this point in time. But the all time high over here for AVAX was at $147.50. Since that point it did then obviously move downwards and eventually break out of that downtrend that it saw there kept moving up a bit of momentum and it looks like it could have potentially actually formed a bit of a cup and handle pattern which is something that is really nice so obviously you can see the cup coming in here my drawing skills aren't the best but we've hit the top end of that cup and we've got basically the handle I suppose forming itself over here so I'm going to chuck that in roughly like that that is the top end of our handle that's formed itself I'd suggest that the bottom end of the handle is probably right about there. We tried to dip below here, we tried to break out here, but no breakout has occurred yet. So we're going to basically keep drifting through this channel until one of these points is broken through. And I think when the breakthrough does come, it will be major. At this point, given that we're in an uptrend at this point in time, you know, we can take a bit of a trend line, put it in place over here. I think we're going to see a potential breakout within the near future. So I'd be suggesting that if anything occurs, it's going to be a bit of a pattern like this. We've tested the top and I think we're going to curve up and go back and test this top resistance point right here and then break out. That would be, I suppose, the ideal scenario for this coin at this point in time. But let's have a look at a few different other indicators as well. RSI will be a really interesting one. It'll show us that we're sitting smack bang in the middle, 48.57. Plenty of room for us to move upwards here. So that does support our theory that if we are going to break out, we can break out upwards, but also we could break downwards based on this as well. So, well, RSI, it's just showing us the buying and selling momentum. At this point, it's not overbought, it's not oversold, it's more just, I suppose, trading in this downward sort of pattern before it breaks in a direction. Now, MACD, let's have a look at that one. In here, you can see we're actually going through a red period as you'd expect, given the fact that we are moving downwards at this point in time. The 12-day EMA did cross below the 26-day EMA, but these two lines are still trending in this direction. We aren't seeing really much of a shift or them coming close together. We did potentially see it here when a test was to occur to break out of this handle here, but it was not to be the case. I do expect now though, we're going to see this hollow out in this sort of a direction, and then we're going to see a breakout and a cross back over of the 12 day EMA above the 26 day EMA and move forward. Of course, a lot of this does depend on the overall strength of the crypto market. Crypto is not performing fantastically well at the moment or fantastically poorly. It is just sort of hovering around a same level. So we need to see a big move occur and hopefully the crypto market picks up in support of it as well. So what would my target be if we did break out of this point? Well, quite simply, it's going to be this point here. It's going to be at about $127 or $126 about here. See how we've got, I suppose, a few touch points at the top end of our cup. That to me is indicating it is a resistance point for us, you can see all over here, we've got points where we've touched. We've touched on multiple occasions here and here. So I think that would be the ultimate target for us to start moving in the right direction. That wraps up today's analysis on AVAX, guys. I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comments section below. Where do you think AVAX will be going in 2022? I'd love to know. Of course, if you did enjoy today's analysis, make sure you do leave a thumbs up. And if you're interested in seeing more of this sort of content, hit subscribe and turn on those bell notifications. I'll leave it there, guys. I hope you have an awesome day. I'll see you next time. Cheers.